Have you ever thought about building a backyard roller coaster? Well, we just built one. We've been having so much fun doing these crazy photos with Harvey since he was born, from doing a chariot with their dog to recreating Gulliver's Travels. And even last year, we filled our house with sand for his six-year-old birthday. This year's photo is a little bit different. In the past, Cassie and I have always come up with all the ideas of what we're gonna do for Harvey and how we're gonna design the picture. But now Harvey's getting a lot older and he has ideas of his own. Recently, we got him this video game where he started building roller coasters. But of course, it's just a video game. Then he came to us and said, Mom, Dad, could we build our own roller coaster in the backyard? And of course, you know what I said? Heck yeah, we can. I'm going to make this one in my backyard, but it's not going to look exactly like it. Okay, show it to us. Woo, over the hill. It goes up. Woo! We quickly realized that building a backyard roller coaster has a lot more engineering than we originally thought. Like, step one, how to bend a PVC pipe. I'm going to put these nails in with my dad and my dad did a heat gun. I'm bending it, I bending it a little bit, but well, my dad didn't notice. So how do you get the trestle to attach to the PVC pipe? What we decided was we'd use a drill press to make a curved piece so it can hug the PVC pipe really tightly. Hopefully that'll be strong enough to hold up the kids. The backyard roller coaster thing has turned out to be a little harder than I thought. I think I need to make the front end of the car have a little bit of um, oscillating power to it. So it rolls fine, but then that side, see how it comes off the track there? Harvey's been obsessed with Mario lately, and so this year we're throwing a Mario party. And we decided that for the roller coaster, we're gonna make it Mario Kart theme. We found this great toddler car at Goodwill, and so I painted it like Mario Kart, and then we realized that Harvey doesn't fit in it. So we had to cut it in half and elongate it a little bit. In order to make some pipe fittings, I'm gonna take this PVC pipe, cut it out, and heat it up in the oven so it's pliable enough to slide into the connectors. So I really hope I don't stink up the house and make the whole place smell like plastic. Luckily, Cassie's brother was able to come by and help us put everything together. We did have a couple mistakes, a couple derailments, But that's okay, we slowly worked out the kinks, got the angles right. And we put safety bars down below that were able to keep it on the track. I wanna go on it when there's a seatbelt and a seat. <laughs> it's reasonable. <laughs> So Harvey's gonna be back from school soon and we gotta test the roller coaster out. We get the Mario themed roller coaster. Cassie, who's gonna test it? Mr. Dummy. Mr. Dummy. Hey, Mr. Dummy. Did you get him all seat belted in there? No, he's too fat. Oh dear. He's too fat for the seat belt. Oh, hey, Cassie. Nope. How do you feel testing it? Nope. Okay, ready, Matt? Yep. Nope. Three. One, no. two, make sure you lean back. Three, go. Oh, she didn't make it. Matt, give her a push over the hump. All right, let's go. Don't 
One, two, three.